Hi everybody, my name is Maria Leone from Bodyline in Beverly Hills and today we're doing an athletic challenging workout for those of you that want to build a little heat into your day, not for beginners, not to be done unless you have a strong healthy body. And this is Nikki, she's going to be helping me out. Come on to your back, pull one knee into your chest and really you press the knee into the chest and feel the lower back go flat to the mat. Pull that leg across the body into a position that feels right for your spine. Use your breath to relax into the stretch. And let's go to the second side. The other knee comes in and really compress it. Use your arms to create a little bit of pressure here. And then pull the leg across the body. Find something that feels right in your body and then relax in the shape. Always remembering that stretching is a result of relaxing into a shape, not force. And come back center, plant your two feet down on the mat, take an inhale, and on an exhale, tuck your tailbone under and peel your hips up off the mat, bone by bone. Inhale at the top and then peel yourself down. Again, inhale, exhale, tuck and peel up, just warming up that spine and peel yourself back down. And last time, inhale, exhale, peel the hips up, feel that nice open position at the front of the hips and peel yourself down and then sit yourself up. We're going to work on a little transition. So your legs are going to be cross-legged for right now. Go ahead and bring your arms forward and take a stretch. Rounding out the lower back. Breathe here into the back body. Deep breath in. And exhale. Now bring your hands in front of you. Shift your weight onto your hands. Lift yourself up and then just sit back down. Let's do that again. Belly in. Lift. Weight onto the hands. And lower down. Again, pull the abdominals in and up. Rock. Lift. And lower down. Let's do one more just to be sure. Rock, lift, so I don't have any weight on my knees, and all the way down. So that's now break down plank. Come onto your hands and knees. The shoulders go in line with the wrists. Step one foot back, and then the other foot back. Squeeze the legs tight together. Pull the abdominals in, and the back of the neck is long. Make sure you're not sinking in the lower back. Make sure you're pushing the ground away with your hands. And lower down and come into rest position. And onto your back. So we'll be using those shapes again in a minute, but now let's go to our traditional Pilates exercises. So bring your two legs up to tabletop, hands to the ceiling. Inhale here, exhale, lift to perfect hundred. Hold it, squeeze the legs tight. And let's lower down, inhale. And exhale, lift, hold. And lower down, inhale here. Exhale, lift, hold, and let's add the breath. Breathing in, two, three, four, five, out, two, three, four, five, two. Keep going. I'll let you know when we've hit 100. Make a lot of noise at home. Hold the body still, but vigorous with the arms. Last time. Pause here. Lengthen the legs out and see if you can lower everything with control to the mat. Hands go over the head. We're going into a roll up. Hands come forward. Exhale, peel in and up. Ouch. Reach all the way forward. Tuck and reel all the way back. It always takes me a few to get warm. Inhale and exhale up. Well, maybe it's going to take more than one to get warm today. Tuck and peel down. Inhale, hands come forward. Exhale up. Stretch all the way back. And last time, inhale. Exhale up. Go ahead and grab the soles of the feet and take a nice stretch. Come back onto your backs. Take the right leg up to the ceiling. Hold it there. Hover the left leg up off the mat one inch. Really sink the abdominals in. 
And now we do leg circles, the top leg circles around and up. Around and up, two, nothing moves. Minimize what you're doing with your arms. Last time, and change legs. So the other leg is up, float the bottom leg up two inches. That adds a lot of challenge to this. Circle the leg, you choose the direction. Around and up, around and up. The hips are still. Feel the action just in the socket. Keep sandwiching the ribs and lower everything down. Pull your right knee into your chest. Lift the head and shoulders up off the mat. Left leg up one inch. This is single leg stretch. Inhale, change. Exhale, change. Continue to float. Keep reaching the legs right out of the socket. Maintain that nice curve in the upper back. It's the chest lifted, not the head and shoulders. So really feel the connection to the center of the body. Last time like that, knees in, lower down. Rock yourself up, cross your legs, hands in front of you, jump back to plank, hold it there. Jump back to a seated position and back to your back. Legs to tabletop, stay here, head and shoulders up into double leg stretch. Inhale, stretch everything out. Exhale, everything in tight. Inhale out, two, and pull in. Stay lifted, three, exhale in, and four, pulling in from the center of the body. Last time, pull in, rock yourself up, cross the legs, hands in front of you, jump back to plank, hold it, jump back to seated, and back on your back. Right leg to the ceiling, grab behind the leg, left leg one inch off, head and shoulders are up. Changing legs, inhale, change, exhale, change. Really use your arms to pull the leg all the way to the forehead for five and four and three and two and one. Bring yourself up, cross the legs, hands in front. Jump back to plank, jump back to seated. Onto your back, legs to tabletop, hands behind the head. Crisscross, rotate one elbow to one knee and pause. Stay here, hold it and deepen, deepen, deepen that shape. Rotate to the other side. Really reach that elbow towards the back corner of your mat. Keep deepening, keep deepening, keep deepening. Again, slow. Twist and hold. Scoop the abdominals. Reach a little deeper with the center of the body. Second side. And hold. And hold. And hold. Let's pick up the tempo. Here we go. Right. And left. And right. And left. And right. And left. And left. And right, triple time for five, four, three, two, one. Come center, roll up. Hands in front of you, jump back to plank. Hold it here. Keep breathing, sandwich the legs. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Pull the right knee to the chest, hold it. Shoulders are down. Take that foot back. Left knee into the chest, hold it. Take the foot back, right knee, right shoulder. Hold, dig deep. Drag the mat back towards your feet. Step it back. Left knee, left shoulder, hold. Pull the shoulders out of the ears. Step back to your knees. Come into rest position. Come back to plank. We're gonna start moving your feet, just walking your feet. Walk your feet open off your mat, feet together. One, two, open one, two, together, one, two, open one, two. Think about your neck, think about the center of the body, everything else still. One, two, one, two, one, two, last time. Onto your knees, back to rest position, and hold it here. Come back to your push up position. Pause here. From here, pull the right knee across the body. Twist. Keep the shoulders square. Keep lifting the leg higher. Make sure you're not arching that lower back. Take the foot back. The other knee pulls across the body. Push the mat away. Feel the rotation in the pelvis. Take the foot back. Let's do it again. 
right? Knee pulls across, little tuck on the tail. Don't twist the neck, don't twist the shoulders. Equal weight on both hands. Take the foot back. Left knee pulls across. And take the foot back. Watch your knees, make sure you're still breathing, everybody. Deep breath into the back side of the body. And big exhale out through the mouth. And let's come back into your full plank or maybe half plank. I'm doing half plank. Nikki's doing full. Let's do a little push up. Inhale down, pause there. Exhale up. Notice I'm opening my elbows. Inhale, so we're not doing chaturanga. Exhale up. What I'm really interested in is right here, this hold. And push. So really take a moment, check in with your spine. All that good Pilates stuff, all those great things your Pilates teachers have taught you, use them. And this might be really small too, which is great by the way, as long as you're keeping the shoulder blades stable. Last one, into rest position. Oh, deep breath in, and exhale. Back to plank. This is gonna be our biggest, most explosive motion. So from here, jump your two feet up to your right hand. Bend your knees. Go back to plank. Second side, bend your knees towards your hand. Back to plank. To the right side, round the back. And out, left side. Tuck the tail. And out, one more each way. In. And out, last time. In. And out, back to rest position. Deep breath into the back side of the body. And exhale. Come onto your belly. Let's go into swan. Hands right under the shoulders. Inhale, lift the upper back, pull the belly in. Hold it here. And lower back down. And again, lift the upper back first. The belly pulls in. The pubic bone stays on the mat and Pilates there. And all the way down. And one more time, inhale, chest comes up. Belly and shoulders out of the ears. And lower it down. Take your body back into rest position. Have a seat with your legs straight in front of you. Pull just one knee into your chest tight. Wrap your hand around and then turn to the back. Drop the shoulders, lengthening the head to the ceiling. And change sides and the other knee comes in. Wrap the arm around the knee. Lift the chest, try not to lean back on this hand. Be upright, let your head turn as well. Come back center, cross the legs, hands on the knees. And let's finish with one deep breath in through the nose. One long, sleep, deep breath out through the mouth. And that's it for today. You can join us live. Go to our website, bodylinela.com. See you again soon, and stay healthy.